Today's show is sponsored by Microjig, maker of the gripper. Work safer, work smarter. Hello, I'm David Picciuto, the Drunken Woodworker, and welcome to my channel. Today, I'm gonna to show you how to make this crate from a $4 two by six that you can get from the home center. It's a real quick and simple process. It can be used for storage, or you can easily stack them and make shelves, or you can do what I'm doing here and use them for my display for my craft shows. Another thing that I like about them is that one will go inside another and you can put one on top for easy storage. Let's get started. I start by selecting my lumber from Home Depot. One $4.92 inch 2x6 will make one crate. The first cross cut will be used for the four inside supports. The next two cross cuts will be used for the slats on the short ends. And then the final two cross cuts will be used for the slats on the long sides. Now, I'll take that piece that'll be used for the inside supports, clean up one end, and then cut four square pieces from it. Then, I'll begin cutting the slats out of the two short side pieces. You should be able to get seven slats from each board. I'll repeat the process and then cut the slats for the long sides from our two remaining boards. Again, you should be able to get seven slats from each board. In total, we'll need 10 long slats and 17 short slats. That means we'll need to cross cut three of our long pieces down to size. This is all you'll have left for scraps, which isn't much. And here are all our pieces. Four inside supports, 10 short slats, and 17 long slats. And now, it's just a matter of gluing and nailing it all up. Accuracy isn't important when making the crates, but using a piece of scrap as a spacer makes for quick assembly. Something that I did not show in the video is that I put screws in the top slats. And I also reinforced the bottom with a few screws. Well, thanks for watching. You can find plans for these crates in the description down below. All right, be safe, stay passionate, and make something.